architecture as a built environment uh, is not just about buildings it's also about what goes inside the building and what goes outside the building so architecture basically takes care of designing of the building whereas interior design takes care of how the design looks like and feels like from inside and bachelor in planning teaches you how to design what is what goes outside the building the roads and the infrastructure and the streets and the villages and the towns and everything what happens outside we have a bachelor of architecture which is a 5 years program we also have bachelor in planning which is a 4 years degree program and we also have a bachelor in interior design which is also a 4 year degree program earlier the architecture uh, used to happen on paper basically a small scale architectural firms used to practice for designing bungalows and you know smaller buildings or institutions nowadays how it has changed is a lot of large scale companies have come up lot of mncs are coming into architecture and built environment uh, scenario they employ like uh, uh, hundreds of architects and draftsmen and planners and designers lot of mncs are coming from outside also and lot of indian mncs are practicing outside india as well because of the computers virtual working lot of people are working from home for the architectural firms as well and lot of uh, off center uh, developments are happening we don't need to go to office so there are lot of changes in that sense because of the computer technology and virtual uh, working that is happening earlier we used to teach them drafting by hand on the drawing boards etc what has changed is we start with the hand drafting because we have to get the concepts clear we introduce the computers in the second year itself and we accept the computer drawings uh, from second year itself so that they work on the sketch up uh, you know 3d modeling and the computer aided drafting and building information modeling on computers when the students go for internships they are required to work on computers basically for uh, say 3d modeling or building information modeling and so we try and give the students that kind of knowledge of working drawings and 3d modeling and rendering and all that so hardwares keep uh, you know improving a lot over the years so at amity we have full fledged computer lab with uh, latest software such as uh, autocad revit uh, we also have sketchup 3d modeling uh, then we have photoshop and corel draw and uh, you know lot of uh, rendering software there are lot of uh, open source software also that students uh, try and work on when a student joins a firm they generally start working with working drawings as a supporting role to the main architect or the project architect but then they start learning the tricks of the trade they start designing small uh, projects and maybe help out a as a team member to the project architect basically architect's role is to design something there is always a group of people Uh, who are working with them such as consultants you know structural consultants uh, mep consultants you know plumbing and electrical and all those and acoustics consultants interior design consultants land landscape consultants these are all maybe architects but in a specific roles uh, which they have carved out a niche for themselves in that profession they can be a town planner they can be urban designers urban planners of course interior designers landscape architect nowadays an emerging field is of digital architecture with the help of digital software and the technology maybe the ai tools and all that they they kind of help us in designing spaces so lot of students are now diving into these kind of digital architectural fields Thank you.